Hello, this is German from Audio Possibility and today's tutorial I'm starting the entire mix on the master feather with EQ and compressor by which every track will go through the processor on the master feather mixing everything together. So in the previous video I talked about the stable mix or the stationary mix that is where you get all the levels and pannings right and then you get the mix coming together so in this tutorial which is the next step is the mix bus processing and this process has to be subtle too much of it could destroy your mix and when you do it well it could make your mix sound better so with EQ, you can make your whole mix brighter if it's dull. And then with a compressor, you can make the whole mix punchy. All right. So let's begin with an EQ. Let's just use the EQ in Cubase. This is a very good EQ. So I'm going to do a little moves, subtle moves little cut a little boost here and there so just uh, watch the way i'm going to do it right now you've shown me no one else have done this you came to die for me you took away my sin So you can hear what the EQ is doing to the whole mix. You know, this step is very, very important because it mixes the whole mix and it sounds better very fast. You know, once you do it well, your mixes will come together. They will sound well before you even start mixing the individual tracks. So with this um stage of mixing you are only mixing the whole um song on one channel which is the master feather you are mixing everything with just few plugins on the master feather so all the the tracks goes through those plugins so right now all the track is going through the eq and when I add a compressor to it, all the tracks will go through the EQ and the compressor. So the EQ makes the song brighter. It changes the tonality of the sound and it brings it together and also enhances the frequencies that needs to be enhanced. So with just a little um, cut um, around the 178 hertz and then a boost around the... Uh, 1 to 2k area and then a little um, brightness from around the 3k area you know a little boost around 3 db and then a little boost um, around um, 2 db around the mid range and then the lower mid a little cut there and then filter a little bit around the 20k area just subtle moves you can hear when I bypass the EQ and I bring it on. You can hear the differences. You can see that when I bypass it, the song is dull. But when I bring it up, the song is, you know, it sounds bright. It sounds, you know, it comes together. So listen to it again. So 
So the next thing is to um, use a compressor. So let's choose a compressor from Cubase. So this is a Cubase compressor, which is very good. You know, so we're going to do it subtle. The ratio, 2 by 1 ratio is okay. And then the attack, let's say around 10 milliseconds. And the release, we want a fast release because we want it to compress so fast. So the release around 10 milliseconds. And then the gain reduction should be between 1 to 4 um, dB of gain reduction. You don't want to overdo this because it's going to squash the sound. You don't want to squash it. But what you want to achieve is a tight, a punchy, and a warm sound. So you don't want to overdo it because if you overdo it, it's going to um, overcook the sound. It's going to um, squash it and then all the transients in the sound will be taken away. You won't feel that natural uh, sound. So you want to avoid that. So just a little gain reduction between uh, 2 to 4 dB of gain reduction. That is okay. So let's listen to it whilst we use the compressor on it. You took away my scene. So um, let's um, make up the gain. So right now we are losing 2.5 dB of gain reduction. So 2 dB of make up gain. So you can hear how the sound is coming together with just two plugins, an EQ and a compressor. So I'm, I'm going to bypass the two. Um, I'm going to bypass the EQ and the compressor and then also bring it on. And then you will listen to how these two plugins is affecting the sound. So this is how you go about your mix bus processing. Very simple, very subtle. In order to enhance the sound, you mix the whole song on one feather, which is the master feather. And just to bring the whole song together, to tighten it, to um, make it bright if it's needed to. And then also to give it a little bit of punch. So before you start applying um, EQ compression whatever on the individual tracks so right now the song is already sounding good this is how you go about it before you go I wanted to click the link below I have a free mixing guide for you to download thanks for watching and I'll come your way again with the next tutorial